What could you do anyway? You're not a builder. It's just... Why did Morgan want to meet in Minrathis? Isn't she helping the Veil Jumpers in Arlathan? Indeed. But today we have a guest, and she needed the anonymity that only a city provides. Well, look who it is. Good to see you, Lace. Rook, you remember how Varric and I served the Inquisition? Well, this is Inquisitor Lavellin, the woman who led us all. Andaran Artishan. Anathara. I wish we could be meeting without our gods threatening to blight the world. A blight that spreads wider with each passing heartbeat. Morrigan and Harding have told me about what you've accomplished since taking over for Varric. You've put together an impressive team, and you've got the best chance, maybe the only chance, to stop Elganan and Gilanane. We've been doing what we can, but I'll be honest, right now, feels like we're in over our heads. You've already faced setbacks. You'll face more. Your actions will have consequences. Did you see what happened to the Viper? We know all about consequences. Such thinking is a trap you can ill afford. The Viper was blighted because of Elgin and Gilanane, but the city of Treviso was saved because of you. I wasn't ready to become the Inquisitor. I wasn't ready to have to choose between helping Templars or Mages, or decide the fate of every Grey Warden in Southern Thedas. Eventually, when the choices I made caught up with me, I disbanded the Inquisition rather than let it turn into another problem. Maybe someday you'll face the same situation. But I'm asking you not to worry about that future until we have one. Right now, we need you to stop the gods. All right. I'll do my best. And while you do so, Rook, the Inquisitor will do her best to ensure that the rest of the world remains intact. A daunting prospect, given that most of the South is under siege by Darkspawn. It's that bad? If not for the Inquisitor, the South would have collapsed completely. She has not been idle while you assembled your team. I thought the gods were mostly active up here. It's really that bad in the south. Elganon and Gilanane have indeed restricted their activities to the north. But the forces they deployed to the south, the strange new Darkspawn, have spread fear and corruption greater than any blight in history. Darkspawn have cut through the center of Vorlay. Valroyo and Halam Shiral are barely holding out. Ferelden would have fallen already if not for help from Orzammar. With Denerim lost, the Ferelden's are holding the line at Redcliffe. The Free Marchers have the worst of it. Acting Viscount Aveline Valen led the evacuation of Kirkwall. She's taking her people and what's left of her army to help Prince Vale keep Starkhaven. Maker, we didn't know. My ma... Don't worry. I called in a favor with the Divine. Your mother's safe with some old friends. Thank you. The Inquisition might be gone, but my name still carries some weight. I've used it to get people working together where they can. Again, the South is my problem, not yours, Rook. You stop the gods, and I'll make sure the rest of Thedas doesn't fall to the Blight. If the South is in such turmoil, why come up here just to talk? And how did you get here so fast? Did you think you were the only one to unlock the secrets of the Illuvians? Morgan helped the Inquisition use the Illuvians to travel. While I lack the Dreadwolf's vir of us, I may still scurry between the walls of this world to be where I might do the most good. The Inquisitor asked to meet you, and I thought it might help you to meet her. What I really need right now is information. If you have anyone who can help... I'm sorry. The only reliable sources of information I have up here are Morrigan, Dorian, and Harding. 
All of whom are already helping us. I understand. The Inquisitor did not come all this way to leave you with empty words, however. She brought something no one else could. A wolf statuette? We've found others like it in the crossroads. Where'd you find yours? I found it right around the time Solus's ritual failed, when he was pulled into the Fade. We've examined the magic, and it's tied to the Veil. To him. Somehow. Solus is ancient, and his magic is part of him in a way far beyond that of mortals. I suggest you take it to the crossroads and see if something in the lighthouse calls to it. Perhaps it will yield some insight into your new ally. Solus is trapped in the Fade. He's not my biggest concern at the moment. Solus is trapped in your dreams. And while he cannot match Elgin and Orgillanane in strength, he is far more cunning. He is the Dreadwolf. He led a rebellion that lasted centuries. How many times do you think the gods thought him trapped and helpless? Solus was... important to me. If this statuette helps you understand him, if it uncovers something that... Honestly, I don't know. I wish I did. But this feels like a part of him. And whatever he and I once were... I think... I, I hope... It might help you. We should go, Inquisitor. The armies in the south need you. Right. Harding, stay sharp. You're my eyes in the north. Always, Inquisitor. Rook, good luck. If I come across anything else that can help, you'll be the first to know. Thank you. We should take a break. Head back to the lighthouse for a bit. <laughs> 